Hi folks, Trish back. It's a um, beautiful Friday afternoon, early evening. Today I have a busy day. I um, was hoping to uh, just max and relax uh, today after work. Um, because it's just been a busy, crazy week. But uh, I was on... Um, I hit the ground running today. Um, I mailed out a few packages. I uh, went to Applegate's Hardware and got um, uh, Betty Lou's list, or part of it, I guess. Um, Joyce is uh, working on the other half. Uh, Lord knows, only knows what she has in store for me. Um, um, it's going to be interesting. And um, then I went to work. After work, I had a little lunch, read the paper, uh, decompressed a little bit. And um, then I went uh, for a haircut and uh, got some CDRs. Then on the way home, I saw this building. Um, it's a small building. I thought it was empty for a while, but uh, it's a little consignment shop, probably the size of my den. But it's nice. The guy um, there was very nice. Um, what's his name? I think Phil. I had a card somewhere. Uh, it's probably in my wallet. Um, <clears throat> and uh, I got a few things. Uh, actually, I got two things. Ah, uh, he ties it up. Phil, oh, hold on, I gotta open this. Don't know why I tied it up by that, but I'm not gonna complain. Um, okay. They had a lot of music, not a lot, but a good amount of musical instruments in there. You know, uh, keyboards, guitars, uh, computers, uh, computer speakers, and and for very low, low prices. <laughs> and um, I think I saw a pair of speakers for like eight dollars, and I thought, hmm, do they work? But um. Anyway, uh, here's what I got. Michael Bublé. Everybody keeps telling me to add this. Um, not everybody, but a few people uh, asked me about my, if I like Michael Bublé. I have his Christmas CD, uh, uh, one or two of his Christmas songs. And uh, I thought I'd check this out. Um, I th I believe he goes along the lines of um, he's along the lines of uh, uh, Frank Sinatra. And I got some CD cases, uh, jewel cases, which were like I think like three bucks. And. Uh, yeah, the the guy's very nice. I asked him, um, I told him I had the box set of Bruce Springsteen, and he said, you know, when you have time, bring it in, and, um, you know, we'll see if he can take it. And uh, I asked him about albums and stuff. He says, well, it depends what it is. So I'll, you know, gather some stuff I don't listen to, some albums and stuff, and uh, see what happens. But he had not a lot of CDs, but a nice, uh, a nice rack of them. And I, you know, I bought the Michael Bublé one and the, you know, the jewel cases. I said, I'll be back. Because, <laughs> uh, you know, I could have spent all day in there. <laughs> and he, he laughed. I said, it, it, uh, you know, seriously, I could spend a whole day in here. He goes, that's okay, you know, but... I think he was get closed in like 20 minutes, so I didn't want to keep him. Um, I wanted to um, go in there when I had more time, and I knew he had more time. Um, and uh, of course, after that, I stopped by uh, Cafe de Point and got a uh, slice of uh, cheesecake and a soda. Now I'm getting thinking of dinner. <laughs> 
Yeah, I had to have a little snack. Um, today was a ba busy, crazy day, as most Fridays are. And um, I like to end my Friday on a good note. And um, someone said something to me, and I was like, what? But I, you know, of course, well, Jill said something to me, and I was like, what? And I, I was like, no, 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 no. I just, I wanted to, you know, uh, uh, rant verbally on the way home, out, out loud, in my car on the way home. I said, no, no, no. Don't let her ruin your beautiful Friday. It was something along the lines that, oh, you didn't, f you know, part of my job is, um, on a Friday is to find all the news articles pertaining to the school in the newspaper. Well, you know, I, I did my best and sometimes you can't f find them all because they're not all online, you know, in the Bayhead section. They're scattered throughout the paper, which makes it difficult, especially when you're interrupted with, you know, other things. You, your train of thought gets and I'm not blaming anybody, but I'm like, I wanted to say, you know what, if you can do it better, God bless you. But I didn't, I didn't, I just, I just, um, I just, I just took and kept my mouth shut, but, oh, you know, um, an old teacher used, once said, that which is in your head doesn't always have to come out of your mouth, and boy how many times has that saved me I just uh, bit my tongue and said have a good weekend <laughs> you know and like one of those things like um cause if I said everything if I said what I wanted to say ooh that would have uh, stirred up a firestorm of trouble on my part we don't want that no so Tomorrow is my gig at the the surf shop, and um, I will give you an update then. Okay, after that. Okay, talk to you later, everybody. Have a great weekend. Peace, love, and keep the good tunes spinning. Bye bye.